first one I probably really tuned in, it was 98, um, and f- for me being Scottish, obviously opening the tournament up against Brazil was um, was a great game, It was a, Brazil were on top form and they were the favourites at the time, and <coughs> uh, going, down, going one nil down and then obviously getting a penalty, um, and then we lost the game, but just in general it was... <laughs> In the, those days, there was a feel good factor because the national team was making the the finals, and um, and Scots we, we we knew we were realistic about our expectations going into these tournaments. But to be there and have the kind of big build up and and having the three games in the group was was fantastic. In recent times, I think it's it's just got to be the way Spain have been playing the whole way through. It's not not any specific goal or move, it's just their, the way they went into every game and started playing not with a kind of false striker and stuff and um, it, it was just fantastic to watch and whatever every team tried to come up with different game plans to play against them, they always had, rose to the challenge and, and, and done really well in every game. That's a good question. There's too many to pick one. Um, but there's... I don't want to pick one that I've maybe seen on a hundred World Cup best goals rather than one I've watched. So um, I couldn't pick one off the top of my head, but I'm sure I've seen a few crackers. Yeah. Ronaldo, uh, and I'm talking about the Brazilian Ronaldo, just because he was a match winner, and 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 most of the years I've watched World Cups, he's he's performed and performed at the highest level. <laughs>